Hey all, this is just a quick video just to show those who are running OSX 10.7 how to get their O1X uh, mixing desk running. Right, so first you need to go to the Yamaha website and download um, the MLAN tools driver. It was that would be the last version that Yamaha decided to um, to make. Once you've downloaded that, go into your MLAN tools, the MPKG, show package contents by right clicking. Um, go into the installers folder and it's the MLAN manager PKG that you're looking for. Uh, right click on that, show package contents, go into contents and the file you're looking for is plist buddy. I think that's, um, it's an old PPC file so obviously it won't work on your new 10.7. Um, what you also need to do, I went to uh, mikecell.info, it kind of gave me the information I needed because you need to see all the files on your system um, because I found that the actual updated version of the PLS buddy resides in a hidden folder. So yep, you do that, show all um, and then you should be able to go back onto your root drive, go into the folder USR or user um, the folders libexc you're looking for and then you should find um, the Intel x86 or 64 bit whichever you want and um, you should find the plist buddy file in there you just need to basically copy that over into your um, your mlan install folder um, well mlan manager into the pkg which you've just opened and then you should be able to run your m2 mlan tools um, installation you should be able to run that without getting a problem um, what you also need to do you need to switch over your kernel from 64 bit to 32 bit the 10.7 operating system i believe is the last one to basically um, feature a 32 bit kernel in there as well as a 64 bit um, you can actually start your computer in 32 bit by holding three and two down um, after you hear the chime but to be honest for me it didn't quite work so I did it the um, manual way then what you need to do is open your terminal window and uh, enter the command the website is noterepeat.com you can basically select the text, copy it, and then paste it into your terminal window, press enter. Uh, it's a bit quicker than typing it all in. Restart your Mac, and then just to confirm that it is running in the 32-bit environment, you need to click on the Apple logo in the top left-hand corner, click about this Mac, then click on system report, and uh, scroll down to software, and then where you see it says 64-bit kernel and extensions, if that says no, then that means you're running in 32-bit mode. Go to your applications folder, find your uh, MLAN tools folder, then uh, double click on MLAN connector. And then you should be able to, well, basically it should see your um, desk and then you can connect to it, basically. I've, what I've done, I've gone onto the audio MIDI setup just to make sure that, you know, the operating system is is recognizing my desk and it's using it as an audio device then I'm gonna go into logic just a test project that I uh, created earlier go on to your logic X um, menu click on control surfaces and set up and uh, well with mine it was already uh, I did that earlier but basically you click on new install and you can scroll down you can find your, your O1X there which is surprising uh, and click add you can actually scan and it should find it also uh, and then basically that's it you're all up and running O1X running on 10.7 32 bit but it seems to be running okay for now uh, my plugins are running fine um, yeah Jobs are good in.